What's up everybody, Jay here, and as you can tell by the mask and the intro, it is time to play Telltale's Batman. If you haven't played a Telltale game yet, or you're wondering who they are, over here, just the list, you know, yes, greatness. So, very excited for this one. Got, got the shirt, got the mask, gonna don it, ready to play. I will say, I've already heard some bad things about the PC version, sadly, because once again, Anything that Warner Brothers touches on the PC somehow seems to come broken. Supposedly, they got a patch out last night that's fixed it, so hopefully no crashes, no freezing, no issues, and this is going to be fun and a good time. So, let's do this. Uh, I guess, spoiler alert also, because I've seen it on other people's videos, whenever they do a Telltale game or a story game, you have to put up a spoiler alert for some reason because people are expecting it to not be spoiled. So, yeah, this is going to be spoiled. Uh, it's going to go off of my choices, so obviously if you play it, it's going to be a lot different. Uh, past that, I hope you guys enjoy it. It's going to be a long one. I'm going to play the whole episode, so let's do this. Alright, so let's see here. Episodes, videos, extras. I already messed with my settings, so hopefully hopefully we don't run into any of those problems. So you're actually able to change the resolution. Episode 1. Can we even look at the other ones yet? Children of Arkham, World Order, Guardian of Gotham. Hopefully these aren't spoiling anything. I'm not even going to read the description just for the sheer fact that I don't want that to be spoiled. Alright. Let's get this going. Ready. Got I got my bat water here. Got, got my mask. Which hurts. This hurts so bad. My big nose and this mask are not a good combination. And you know what, real quick, I think I saw it on the on the screen before. They have a thing called crowd play, which is awesome, I guess, if you're doing something like I'm doing, but you have a big enough audience for it, is that you can have other people play on their phones or on their PCs and make the selections too, and the popular vote gets the choice. So your decisions can be totally based off of what the other people playing with you actually pick, which I think is a really cool thing to do for these games. All right, now we got select a bat tech color, which changes. Oh, well, this is an easy one, blue. Favorite color, wins. That loading screen though, geez. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. The loading screen took like 45 seconds. I just wanna throw that out there. Pat Downey. Hey, what are you? Oh! Recently deceased, Pat Downey. Oh, you Get done messed up. On it. Think he's gonna show? He'll bring the whole goddamn place down. Stay focused. We'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. Oh, are you scared of the bat? You better fear me. I am the darkest knight. I was thinking about doing like the Christian Bale voice during this, but my Move throat in. can't handle that. Stories, you know. Sent three home in an ambulance. The rest in body bags. No wonder the cops want him dead. Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo. With all the other flying animals. Are they gonna go with the good old mantra that Batman doesn't kill? Because then you guys are wrong about the body bags. Oh, E. E again. 
press E to pay your respects. Even though I guess that was F, wasn't it? Huh? You see him coming. Don't just stare, stupid. Keep doing this. I have to. <laughs> no one else will. Every drop of blood, everything you've sacrificed. The city is safer now. But it's made you a target. And people will keep you in the crosshairs oh. until you're shot out of the sky. That's, yeah, the, that's point. the point. Let them come. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> that, that scream of death. The hell did he go? Whatever got in, don't let it get out. How was he the only one to notice? He crashed through the window. You think that like, everybody that was in that room would have noticed? What was that? Okay. WASD is the normal directional buttons here. Why is that not working? So this definitely has a lot more quick time events than any of the other Telltale games. Probably to help those people that kind of want it to feel more like, uh, like the Arkham games. Danny now. They're gonna make this complex. Let me control Alt E in here in a second. It would have been great if their bodies would have spelled out help. I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come on! That's how we Come get on. made. Oh, Come on! on. Oh, I don't think I hit down in time. I mean, it did the action, but I didn't hit down. That is for sure. It's like Dance Dance Revolution of, of Batman games right now. like the x-ray move for Batman. He done whooped his ass. Didn't your mother teach you to knock? Ooh. Behind you, big boy. Huh? Heyday. Better not touching any of my stuff. Get her. Catwoman ain't getting away. Stay where you are. You're under arrest. <laughs> not a chance. So why did they take out their guns if they weren't even going to use them? Criminals are becoming afraid of you, so are the police. It's a scare tactic, Al. Just a performance. <sighs> the 
without a scratch. So far. What are you gonna ruin it? Is that, that what you're doing? Doesn't for? belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You broke the law. Here I am. <laughs> Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell me that's why you do all this. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in Arkham. Gotham needs a hero. Someone to hunt down people like you. So that makes me, what, a villain? Sounds I like the, the voice modulator he's using. Gotta admit that was pretty cool they showed him even turn chase. on. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. And let's put you in a cage. Bring it, Bat. Part of me kind of hopes she kicks his ass. Just to show a little bit of weakness even early on. Like my Batman's vulnerable. Other than just by mom's names. That whip. I, I do not condone the beating of women, but he done punished her good. Body drop and work though. It's over. Spear. I wouldn't be so sure. <laughs> that was pretty nice. Get over here. Seriously, he's got scorpions moves. They have the x-ray vision already. Jesus! I got it. Wait, wait, wait! Do not shoot! They just want to watch the fight play out. Go to all that trouble for this. Shit. A myth can't be killed. You, however, are flesh and blood. Oh, who shot him? God damn it! I said don't shoot! No! Wait! <laughs> That's not good, though. Can we not kill Catwoman this early on? That'd be awesome. Batman to be a little vulnerable. I would expect his armor to stop bullets, though. Ugh. Guess I was wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. <laughs> Don't struggle or you'll fall. Oh, but that's what you crave. The struggle. I know men like you. Bye, Bat. <laughs> oh, you bitch! Took my grappling hook. <clears throat> no. 
Step out of the shadows. So time for a quick life inventory. Bruce Wayne We've been tonight. shot, scratched oh, in the face, or hanging from the side of a building with no grappling hook. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Well then. Time to save the city. And if the voice sounds familiar, it is Troy Baker, for anybody who Thank didn't you. know that. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. So, you know, last a humble of district us. attorney like myself is not Arkham used Ni to such yeah, a ringing Arkham endorsement. Games. And even one who cut Gotham's Bioshock, crime rate in half. Uh, Bioshock Infinite. Now, for too long, Played this Booker. city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your Heartbreak. foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. Say hi, Bruce. Hi, Bruce. Oh, I can do it, hi, yes. Hi, Bruce. <laughs> well, I tee him up and he knocks him down. That's how Mr. Wayne and I do business. Thank you, thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Together. We will change Gotham. No, but Mr. Harvey Wayne, Dent looks gigantic. thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. It's just working the night shift. Yeah, well, then you're pulling a double. No one came here tonight to see me. Some champagne. They want to see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> and I can Does see him Dent just know fine from here. That he's Batman this shouldn't in this be one? painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little FaceTime with potential donors. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families yeah, again. Finish that drink first. Ah, a little liquid courage before facing your adoring public? This'll help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. I mean, I always oh my god, I was gonna say put salesman. a dent in something, I couldn't even think of Which, crime. for the record, I have not been since before law school. All right, all right, all right. How about, uh, put a dent in crime, hmm? Look at you, it's not half bad. I'm gonna use that. It's not half good either, Bruce, but still. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can shake start with a few a hands, hmm? I can't do Vince McMahon's voice. I can barely do my own voice, what am I talking about? So is Catwoman going to be here? Pause. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Ouch. Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. <laughs> well, I'm flattered, truly, but this night is about getting Harvey Dent elected so he can fix those potholes. <laughs> I think I speak for half the room when I say politicians are puppets. Oh, come Damn on right. Now, Bob. Let's make this political. I'm not a politician. I'm a crusader. Hmm? No strings attached. Old families like ours should flock together, you know, like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Oh, this city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. 
Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall. I was going to say, he's going to riff on Batman. Dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding Golden Age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. Get There's off my always lawn. hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. And it's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Well, you definitely I have to say don't get a lot of time to make these decisions. This, and I like that. Even make, a spark you know, of hope can light on your feet. Oh, an idealist with a bank account. He'll be broke before election day. <laughs> and I know Bruce would gladly spend every penny he has to fix this city. I don't doubt that for a moment. Then why hasn't Don't worry, he? though. I am not doing this alone. And with Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway, it was terrible, truly terrible. Yeah, and tragedy like that at such a young age. Are we gonna retell the if only that the killing of his parents deranged again? Deranged man had gotten the right treatment. Maybe, uh, well, I don't like to think about maybe. Be sympathetic, and I'm sure you don't either. Well, thank you. I wish my parents could be here speaking with you too. And thank you, Bruce, for investing in the health of this city's future. You have our support, Mr. Dent. Go get him. We're on our way. <laughs> Not saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. It is a night of ringing on, endorsements. Are they gonna dance? Do we get a dance number with these two? Oh, well, hello. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale. Not interested. And reporter for the Gotham Gazette. <laughs> this is a Shut private down. fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. No, no, it's all right. I gotta stay in character. You can stay. Thanks. I gotta, I gotta be a ladies' man. Bruce? This is quite the social event, Mr. Oh, Wayne. Oh, come on now. So formal. Call me Bruce. Well... <laughs> Bruce, you've well, been been going around later. pleasing everyone tonight. But how are you doing? How are you doing? You should enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Well, I'm doing better now that you're here. Well, I'll tell you, if all these stuffed shirts weren't around, I'd give you the private tour. Oh, yeah. Mr. Wayne, you've, you've got something on your collar. Um, is it blood? <laughs> is that blood? Yeah, it looks like. Oh, cut myself this? Shaving. No, that's nothing. It just uh, cut myself shaving. What? Your butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding. Ouch. Kidding. Dick. Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but uh, oh, another who shows up guest to, uh, right on cue. has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Carmine Falcone. Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Oh, somebody's Excuse in us, cahoots. Miss Vale. When he's known as being part of the big, from the biggest and crime family, and you automatically go, no, he's want? just a businessman. The one that you controls know enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham for all of us. At least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. I don't like this, Harv, but I'm trusting you. Thank you, Bruce. Seriously. You know I have to pull every string I can to get elected. Yeah, well, just make sure this one doesn't hang you. A word of warning, Bruce? Play nice. You know, I've been in the market for I'm gonna a new house. I'm going to string him up from the chandeliers. Decent walk-up, sky-high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. That voice sounds familiar. I think familiar. I'll take it. Though the decor offends my eyes. Oh, <laughs> man, all flash, no class. Let's talk privately, shall we? 
Hey, I like this guy. Ready to do business before we even introduce you know, ourselves. Bruce Wayne looks so sad in all we'll these scenes so far, other than when he was hitting on Vicky Vale. He looks Thank very you sad. For welcoming me into your home. You're a respectable man, I hear. Bruce Wayne. I know who you are. The guy who's gonna sell me his house. Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me. So they're gonna remember me shaking somebody's hand? Is it really that bad? I mean, I get that they've already established he's a, a crime boss. Uh, you should know, Mr. Falcone. It's not that bad to shake somebody's say hand. We're raising triple with Mayor Hill. At... Hey, what's... Private audience. Oh, come on, guys. Bruce? You'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Oh. Have a drink, have a talk. Nope, he comes with. Harvey stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. Seen and not heard. Whatever you... Ah, ah, what did I say? Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just saying he will. The man talks too much, chaps my face with words. Well, I would say you can uphold the law and still do what's right. To a point. No one gets remembered for staying in the middle. Uh, Mr. Falcone, I... No more warnings. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to be heard, buddy. I ain't Quiet. here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationship. There's gonna be Chalk a fight here. Me. Be a pal. I can get Harvey oh. the mayor's seat, or I can pull it out from under him. I'm not your puppet, buddy. Whatever happened to being a gracious host? You started being okay, a dick. Okay, imagine. This is me. And these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. I make them all move, and I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home, hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. Between your businesses and mine, I bet we employ half the city. Look, I'm only talking to you because Harvey asked, trusting a friend to know what's best for Gotham. Now that's a predicament. You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. Oh, don't be trying to bring daddy into this. And which to break. Oh. Don't you dare talk about my father. You're getting worked up over nothing. <laughs> Hell, I knew him longer than you did. People don't say no to me. Oh, I'm gonna say no right now. Not for long. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. Damn, I recommend that party was seeing them quick. out. You wouldn't want to be rude. So Heed your butler's advice, kid. Do they have like a listening device? Oh, was Alfred I'm no able longer to interested in buying the house. The owner's a prick, and he's gonna get what's coming to him. So many games like doing this lately, where you play for like an hour, it feels like, and then they give you the actual intro. 45 minutes later, title screen.
It's me. <laughs> Who needs like the clap or anything? It's me. Episode one. Phantom Bruce. Realm of Shadows. Book of Shadows. Blair Witch 2. Shitty movie, by the way. Another brutal week in Gotham, folks. A string of home invasions rippled through the city's already crime-infested East End. Apparently, the bandits are using stolen GCPD battery rams to force their way in. With breaking and entry incidents... Those are the tickets from the night's parent side. Why would those be out of the case? We think that's something he would never want to open. Tonight. And we have breaking news tonight. Five criminals are in custody this evening after a break-in at City Hall. The notorious Batman was on the scene, but failed to secure the stolen items. Not all of them. Let's see what she was really after. Allegations that Dent may have actually been involved in the break-in. Talk about dirty politics. Oh, here we go. Wow, we can look at everything. Accusations hold any water with the voters. And you can walk around. All right. Is a desperate attempt from a oh, we got the cow lenses. Voice modulation. Wayne Enterprises really outdid themselves with this version. I'm about to go buy the one that you can get at the store that has the little voice changer on there. I gotta fit in with, with Batman next time. The blaze at the Otisburg Processing Center, owned by Ace Chemical. Still no word on what started the fire, but whatever's burning in there has resisted everything the fire department has thrown at it. They're recommending people avoid the area. And can we just watch the TV for a bit? To oh, right click to back out. Okay. Black smoke. And one mobster's murder caused quite a headache for commuters this morning. The body of Falcone family capo Louis Pistachio yeah. Carmona. It almost just looked like it just straight up said the dent. The side of the DA dent. Bridge, sometime just right. before dawn, Exit. causing traffic to back up for miles as the cops cut him down. This is the basic codex. Random stabbings are the latest headache for the riders. I know there was a codex in the main menu too from when I was doing the settings earlier, so this is probably yeah. Are investigating multiple cases of riders receiving a we can look through that later. from an ice pick or other pointed weapon while pressed oh, into the tight quarters with fellow passengers. A few the back computer should be able to read whatever data is on that stolen drive. Critical condition. The police don't have any suspects. Can we turn it off the, the TV. Two more patients have gone missing from Arkham Asylum, bringing the total number of escapees from the half prison, oh, half mental hospital to 15 this year. Only three have been caught to date. Spare grapple. Can't believe I let her take that. Well, the test run at the mayor's office was a success. Oh, was a test run on some of this stuff? Can deliver a jolt or knock out electricity in the area. I suppose that cat woman would have preferred the latter. So how long have I been Batman the newest in this universe? Can program it to reveal trace elements in a confined space. The new law was created in order to allow Gotham range. Should see if I can refine the edge. Could be sharper. And improve the city's aging building, some of which have been occupied by families for decades. So I think that's, that's it for the gadgets. And find all your stuff on the street. Is that everything? Oh, the Batsuit. The suit absorbed most of the damage from that gunshot. I've got to protect my back. Even from the police. I wouldn't say it absorbed most of that shot. It still penetrated. That sucks ass. Nearly fell off a building for this? So I wonder if they're gonna have like an actual detective mode in here. I mean, they've got fighting. Find out what was so important. So they have already pulled a little bit from Arkham. So maybe you actually do investigating? Little investigation mode. Wayne Manor has seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, a basketball court, and a movie theater. And yet I always find you here. Best Wi-Fi in the in house. In a dark, right here. damp cave. 
in front of a computer. I'm more at home here than the rest of the house, you know that. Then we should build an eighth bedroom down here. Sure, I can see the headlines now. Bruce Wayne, billionaire, entrepreneur, cave dweller. Quite Spanker. an eclectic resume. Did you find out what that um, cat woman tried to steal? Well, in the process. What are we looking at? Let me try a different angle. Heck. Well, that's a nice little gadget. Okay, it can rotate. What am I looking for? This is a map of the east side shoreline. Could mean any number of things. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry cleaning. Hmm. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. And in the meantime, I saved you what I could. Is that going to be like a think so. running theme in the in the I mean, episode? The is that you're said for the bar, kind of constantly I coming back, like as you find stuff when you're out, you come away. back and you can decode but you'll be more. But pleased to hear everyone has left, including Mr. Falcone. Before the game switched from billiards to cutthroat, I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. Yeah, thanks for the interruption. Well, it wasn't for you, Bruce. I was worried I might drink all my good scotch. <laughs> for the record, your so, yeah, father so he can hear despised men like Falcone. Thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Back when it still had one? It can again, Bruce. Though people like this Catwoman aren't helping. Is she new to town? I've never seen her before. Hopefully, she's just a tourist. I'll check the codex. What do we got here? Codex. It's the Gotham feed. Let's actually, I guess, scroll through this. Can we just use that and go faster? Nope. Oh, Martha! Why did you say that name? God, that was... I'm sorry, I hated that scene. Catwoman. Right. Wish I knew more about her, too. I called her Selena Kyle. I'm hoping that's who they're rolling with. I don't see why they wouldn't. Not much to find, apparently. A few burglaries, break ins. Seems to lay pretty low. You could learn a thing or two from her. You can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately. As Bruce or Batman. That's not the point. I want criminals to know I'm out there. Batman isn't hiding from anybody. I was talking about Bruce. I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's gonna figure it out now. Trust me. Miss Vale noticed your injuries. So did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. You're in the spotlight more than ever. You're right, you're right. I should have canceled the event. But I know how much pressure you're under. So will they actually Don't reveal his identity in this series? It's okay. I, I know you're only looking out for me. If we make a suit that fits me, we can trade places some night. Though I'm not partial to heights. <sighs> Old men worry, that's all. It's our gift and our curse. One more worry for the list. Take the business card. I thought I saw Oz. It's been, what, 20 years? Last time I saw him, we were in grade school. Indeed. You two were thick as thieves. Oswald, however, <laughs> took picture. that role more literally than you. Dishonorable discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stents? 
That's a criminal grand slam, if I'm using the expression correctly. Unfortunately, you are. Oswald claimed he only wanted to catch up, but his behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. Why he's returning now, I haven't the faintest idea. I think he just wants to reconnect. Criminal record or not, he's still an old friend. A lot can change over the years. If I remember still, correctly, this Oswald mask sucks, was by the way. Let me tell you, because this thing's hurting my nose. Toilet trick. I worry what he's Let's graduated to. Real quick. Even though you and young Master Cobblepot used to be close, I'd advise you to be cautious. But I know you can't abandon a good mystery until it's solved. I'll be careful, Alfred. When you see what's become of his park, I think you will. I was going to say, is he going to actually become the penguin in this? They're hinting at a lot of characters. I will say, and even from the trailer, they did a good job. I think the only one they ever showed was Catwoman. Newspapers. No, I walked too far. Go back. <laughs> I want to go read the paper. Go back. Oh, can I? Oh, they're just gonna watch. He just leaves. I just skipped a whole section of the game. Interesting uh, standing animation to finish that off. Oh, thanks to me shaking his hand. <laughs> He's over there coughing. Bullshit. Talk to him. Oh, give him change. Uh, thank you, sir. No, don't you buy beer with that. I'm just kidding. Good job examining. That was pointless. Nothing over there. No, I was just trying to look at the flower bed. There's that animation. That whole coming out of the automated walk. This looks ridiculous. That way, nope. Look at the burning barrel. You wouldn't be cold if you wore a jacket. Great. Well, there's the statue, but no Oz. Well, yeah, he said he's running late. Of course he's not going to be there. Somewhere in this area, there is a grocery store that is totally pissed off at the amount of carts they're losing. Hey. Beat it. Somebody looks like they beat your face. Damn. Oh, not going that way. More graffiti. More graffiti with no point. Cobble pot? No, it isn't a what cobble it used pot. To be. Ooh, I can't talk. I almost went cobble park. I was gonna I was gonna mix it. Sound a little more Bostonian. Cobble park. Let me guess. I'm supposed to just look at the statue and then he's gonna show up.
Watch Wallet Cash. But this goes through you. Well, and you heard him, man. Yeah, try and take go it. Ahead. There we go. That's the try and take it. That's the proper the response. You say? End him, gentlemen. Oz, keep walking, all right. This don't concern you, twerp. You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. And you're oh. in the moment. Come oh. here. Think that'll do? Quick time fighting. Stay down. Oh. Bashed his brains in. This used to be a nice place. No lives like you don't belong. <laughs> oh, he just Looney Tunes his ass. This is my park. Mike! You hear that? <laughs> oh, hey, Bruce. You've got a little, uh... <laughs> you got a little schmutz hey, on your face. Good as new. Woo! That was the right little scrap, eh? Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? Well, thanks for the backup. I yanked you away from your bloody ivory tower, Bruce. Least I can do is make sure you don't get shanked. Oh, that's that's really the nicest you. thing you could probably After do for me. One. I appreciate Two that. Two decades. And you know what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> uh, that wasn't why I brought you here, mate. Right now, I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. Back when it wasn't, you know, like this. This park used to mean something. A place that was safe for kids, for families. People came from all over to visit. It's a shame what happened. This place looks effed. It was beautiful once. And now it's a hellhole. Last thing my parents ever built. Ah, <sighs> this city chews right through people. Are you Sharon? Mum. Nope. Committed to Arkham. Dad. Ended it yourself, he did. My family's fortune. There's nothing left, Bruce. I know. Alfred told me. You asking for money? It's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you the good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Oh, Pub he's... And parties, round the world he's mad at him. He's gonna hold it against them. potential. Now all I got is this park. I'm... I'm sorry, Oz. No one should have to go through that. Thanks, Bruce. But we are not the only ones suffering. Good to know you haven't changed, Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. <laughs> Can I borrow $20? Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Falcone at your party last night. Oh, he's gonna Make think he's all buddy-buddy. That oily... Oh. No, 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 no. I only agreed to meet him because of Harvey. Beware of any man who smiles that much, Bruce. They're usually hiding a forked tongue. Falcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. All he needs is a little push. And... It'd be a treat to watch him at pavement. Damn. Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. Things are gonna be on the upswing soon, no? A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. And I'm here to let it in. What are you planning? Which brings me to you, Bruce. You see, you throw a rock in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises owns. As the rich and powerful go, Oh, you top Gotham's list. But when my revolution starts, we're gonna smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like Damn. I said, it's not gonna be pretty. It's gonna be beautiful. I'm not your enemy, Oz. That remains to be seen, don't it? I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really do. 
Which is why I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Okay, but you just said you're gonna smash like all my windows that I, you know, I own all Good over the city. Bruce, but I as you start to wreak come. havoc. Cheers. You you kind of already drew the line. Shouldn't have been like more like, hey, I want to make sure you're on my side before this happens. Mm -hmm. Press conference for new hospital start soon. I don't know, that's just an awful approach to try to say, hey, I want you on my side when, you know, shit hits the fan. Are they moving? Oh, look at him just rolling up in that. Suicide doors and everything. Mr. Wayne, over here, right here. This way. They call him Mr. Bruce. That blonde girl is infatuated with him. I saw that. Good morning, everyone. Nice. Morning, Mr. Dent. Hey, Bruce, you mind if we swap cars? I mean, mine isn't fast <laughs> and the paint's rusting off, but boy, does she have charm. We didn't bring you all out here to discuss cars, honestly. <sighs> now, we're here about Arkham Asylum. Ever I since it opened its doors, Arkham has been a breeding ground for the criminally insane. Its methods for rehabilitation, crude. Its security, <laughs> Alfred, lacking. What's up? We're still, those who do get out, or God forbid escape, are even more dangerous than before they went in. Arkham Asylum is a cancer on Gotham. <clears throat> But today, like, am I going to call a him in the middle of the contribution press conference? From this man here, we break ground on a state-of-the-art mental health care facility, one that will improve the well-being of Gotham and its citizens for years to come. And Mr. Wayne has a few words he'd like to say. Bruce. Oh, 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 oh. For those with mental health issues, there are no cuts or scrapes. Their ailments are often invisible, but inside, they're suffering. <sighs> you know, when I was uh, nine years old, my parents took me to see a movie about a hero in a mask. It was a hero who stood up to oppression and defended the people from injustice, no matter the cost. That night, my parents paid the ultimate cost defending me from a man. who needed the kind of help this new facility will provide. Oh. Let us honor their memory with this new facility. Oh, I probably should have really the done the catchphrase. And a night like huh? that never happens again. It felt better to have the emotional response. Today, you're trying to get people on your side. On the anniversary of that fateful night, we dedicate this facility to Thomas and Martha Wayne and usher in a new era of healing for Gotham. That lone leaf. I'm uh, sure you all have plenty of questions about the new hospital, so let's open it up. You first, Miss Vale. Thank you. With well, the opening of this first. new hospital, what does this mean for Arkham Asylum? What happens to the old building? I think Arkham has only done harm to Gotham. It's made criminals more unstable, put our citizens in jeopardy. We can do better. All right, who's up next? Uh, you there. Mr. Wayne, Julia Remark of the Tribune. My sources say you welcomed alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone into your home. Oh, here, here we go. You even shook his hand. Oh, oh, oh. Well, I think Mr. Falcone is a voter just like anyone else in this city. He came to learn about Harvey Dent, your next mayor. Next question. Please keep your questions on topic, people. We're here about the hospital, remember? Read it. 
But Mr. Uh -oh. Wayne, this morning the Globe received evidence of an offshore bank account managed by Carmine Falcone and your father, Thomas Wayne. What exactly are you implying? Transactions connected to organized crime going back years and continuing to this day. Oh, the paper trail ties your them. family directly to the mob. Care to comment? And did anyone else receive this evidence? The Globe, the Gazette, we all did. Mr. Wayne, oh, Mr. Mr. Wayne, is all your money dirty? Is the Wayne family legacy built on lies? Did you know about this, Bruce? How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? What aren't you telling us? Does the mob sign Wayne Enterprises' oh, paychecks? See, I, I'm not going to hide from this you stuff. you should check your source. Sounds to me like an intern is finally putting their creative writing minor to good use. Mr. Wayne, Mr. Wayne! How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations oh, be true? The phones are ringing like crazy. Did you know about this, Bruce? What aren't you telling us? I'm sorry about this, Bruce. I don't know where the hell it's coming from. Damage controls my territory. We'll talk later. Everyone, everyone, coming please from settle Dent. down. I'll be fielding your questions from here on out. Please, let's inside try to keep source Dent. Bruce, I've been trying to reach you. The police are inside the manor. Oh, snap. This is all about the records hey, about hey, his careful. dad and Falcone. Put it back. I'm afraid we can't, Mr. Wayne. Says who? This warrant. I've got an itch, and it's under the mask. It's not personal. I had the boys turn the lights off, keep a low profile. There's got to be a mistake. That's what we're here to find out. Maybe we made a mistake. Maybe you did. Alfred, keep an eye on them. Make sure they only take what they have to. Of course, sir. I meant what I said about not personal. We only want files related to Wayne Enterprises. The warrant covers go, your place, part of places Wayne of residence, and any companies you own. Your holdings are extensive. Who authorized this? I know you and the DA are buddy buddy, but this one came from the top. It's a valid warrant. I gotta serve it. Mayor Hill signed off on this himself. As long as he's mayor, he calls the shots. Well, Hill has a history of making his opposition disappear. Rumors and allegations, Mr. Wayne, that's all. But if well, they wouldn't become this be a rumor facts, and allegation I'll too? handcuff him myself, same as any other crook. I don't know how your neck ended up on Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we are. Hill knows if I go down, Harvey's campaign goes down too. That'd be a real shame. Mr. Dent's the only DA I ever trusted to make a conviction stick. As mayor, I think he can finally turn things around for us. For all our sakes, I pray you've got nothing to hide. And they've broke something. Oh, let me guess, it's a picture of his family. Or his parents. I like how that cop just didn't even care that he was breaking stuff. Bruce, stay back! Take whatever you want! You... you don't have to do this. As much as we all love and know the backstory, Bruce? I hope that's about as all that, all that they show of it, because I think we've I, seen. I didn't mean to interrupt the but... Thomas and Martha stuff way too many times, especially in recent history. Uh, it's it's not a problem, really. Ah, <sighs> Bruce. First the mayor's office, now Wayne Manor. <laughs> Gotham continues its streak of break-ins. Yeah, <laughs> really going for the record, huh? Listen. Bruce, a scandal surrounding a beloved family like yours captures the public's attention. I can help you get the right kind of attention. Oh. Through my connections at the Gazette, I have oh. all kinds of access. 
I can dig up whatever you need to fight this. I appreciate the offer, Miss Vale, but trying to say I'm the good guy here... Instantly makes you look bad. I get it. So let me say it for you. The Gazette received this supposed evidence like every other media outlet, and it's all hearsay. Flimsy sources. There isn't a shred of hard proof. Still, allegations like this, they, they don't magically appear. Someone is going after my family. After me. Obviously, the sender didn't identify themselves. We have no idea who it could be. I got two. No one's even done their due diligence on this yet. The press saw the fumble, they grabbed the ball and ran. Hill wants me out of the picture because with my backing, Harvey wins in a landslide. All signs point to Hill. <sighs> You're a kingmaker, Mr. Wayne. And Harvey Dent is Gotham's knight in well, shining armor just on, waiting for the world's greatest crown. detective. You're the first target. We should be trying to figure it out list. right now. Kick her out and let's get to work. By tonight, this scandal will be broadcast to every screen in Gotham. Everyone will be talking about it. This isn't my first pass through the rumor mill. I know the damage it can do. Then go on the record. Right here, right now, and stop it. You need to get out ahead of this. Your side is what matters, not wild Ooh. speculation. On the record. She's just trying to get a story out of me. Whenever you're ready. Whoever fabricated these lies about my family, they will get what they deserve. Understood? That's exactly what the people of Gotham need to hear. Yeah! Put your foot down. Now kick her out. You're gonna beat this, Bruce. The Waynes always come out on top. Goodbye, Miss Rail. To the back cave, let's figure this shit out. Let's go. He looked like he was about to slam the door. I hate to admit it, but everyone smells smoke. A fire is heading this way. Batman has made plenty of enemies, but my family. We've done nothing but support Gotham, even in its darkest days. All this on the anniversary of your parents. It's not a coincidence. Harvey's the district attorney. He should have told me this was coming. Then find out why he didn't. Because he's two faced. Yeah, went there. A warrant? What the hell's going on? Wait, does this have to do with what the reporters were talking about this morning? That press conference turned into a bloodbath. You tell me. Shh, come on, keep it down. Let's avoid making another scene, shall we? The press is already up my ass as it is. Mayor Hill authorized this? Yeah, then the cops raid my house, taking everything related to Wayne Enterprises. Computers, hard drives, files. Oh, son of a bitch. You're the goddamn DA, Harvey. I didn't know about this, I swear. Hill totally blindsided me on this one. God damn it. <sighs> okay, I, I believe you, Harvey. Mayor Hill. I shouldn't to believe him, but I think it's gonna be the best way to get info. And then he's made two enemies. I just don't get it. Why would Hill stick his neck out over this? Just to tangle you up in some frivolous investigation? That just doesn't make sense. I mean, what could he possibly hope to accomplish other than a few cheap headlines? That is exactly what I intend to find out. Easy, Bruce. <laughs> Calm God, down there, buddy. This ain't the Wild Bruce, West. I wish I could just make this go away, but I'm not sure if yeah, I can. I'll bring that reference back if up. If I get in the way of this investigation, Hill would be able to spin it as a conflict of interest. And that wouldn't be good for either of us. It would jeopardize the entire campaign. Then I'll go it alone. I've got plenty of resources to fight this. We're in a bind here, Bruce. I'll do whatever I can to help. There you are. Hey, you. Sorry. I got a habit of being late. Oh. No, no, just glad you made it. Hello, Catwoman. <laughs> oh, the love scars. You didn't tell me you were bringing a friend to dinner. This is Selena. Ha, it is Selena I hope I'm Kyle. not interrupting Good. anything. Just election nonsense. I'm Bruce Wayne. So you are. Pleasure to meet you, Miss... Kyle. It's 
a strong grip you've got there. Oh, yeah. Don't worry. I'm not gonna fall. Oh, right. Sorry. Selena's new to town. I've been showing her around Gotham, introducing her to people. You're an excellent tour guide, Harv. Well, if I lose the election, I guess I can drive one of those double-decker tour buses around town. Meet anyone interesting? Not really. Just some dude in spandex. They haven't all been as welcoming as Harv. I was mugged. I'm just angry I let that masked freak get away with all my stuff. <laughs> Ouch! I still can't believe I let you walk home alone. I should have called you a car. Well, I sure hope whatever he took wasn't too valuable. Actually, it was. It's probably long gone by now. Whatever that idiot took. I hey. hope not. These were important Only I get materials. to call myself an idiot. Ooh, sensitive? Very. I don't know how I'm going to explain this to my client. When things like this happen in my line of work, people tend to overreact. We should just be thankful you got away with a black eye. Maybe it's time to find a new job. I don't need career advice from you, Mr. Wayne. Not all of us were born with trust funds and multi-billion dollar corporations. Hey, hey, go easy on Bruce. Yeah, I was gonna say, that's not his fault he was born election. rich and good looking. At least I'm not the only one who's taken a beating. That press conference? Oof. We've got it under control. Ouch. Do you? I'll handle it. Someone at my office has to know what's going on. Uh, excuse me a moment. Here we go. They're they're hey, gonna ID each other right here. Don't play coy with me, woman. Oh, the tension, the music. Oh, don't tell me this is gonna be a stare down. Nice to meet the real you. Likewise. This explains a lot, actually. How you can afford the fancy armor, the toys. <laughs> Wouldn't Harvey be surprised? <laughs> Not to mention, everyone in this cafe. Sorry about the black eye. It's not the first time a man's hit me. Sorry to hear that. Don't yeah, that's worry. not something to I'm not say gonna with expose a smile. You yet. I'm curious about something, though. I do what I do for money, but you're... Bruce Wayne. What's your excuse? I Justice. have to. But you... Why take the risk? I don't need one. I do this... because I can. And I thought you were on some noble crusade against crime. Silly me. Uh, I don't know if I really went with the right answer there, though. I don't like you how have any something of them really that belongs worried. to me. I want it back. This is awkward for me. I'm used to robbing people, not the one being robbed. As I recall, you took something from me, too. Hope <laughs> you're getting some use out of that grappling gun. I'm more interested in how I can use you. Oh. These people I'm working for, they don't screw around. If I fail to deliver that drive, it's going to cost a lot more than money. Well, looks like you've made your bed. No, we've made this bed, and I'm not gonna lie in it alone. You owe me. Giggity? If they don't get what they want, there will be consequences. I don't like consequences. All right, you want my help? You got it. What can I do? You can give me back the drive. <laughs> nope. <laughs> not possible. Listen, I don't have a lot of time. My employer is expecting me to drop it off. Where? Just give it back. The address, now. No, give me the drive. Nope. Uh, Selena, say please. Please, give me the address. Oh, he says please when he wants to. Damn okay, right. Okay, Bruce. Seeing as I'm screwed either way. My contact. He'll be expecting a cat. Not a bat. When are you supposed to meet him? Fifteen minutes ago. Better hurry. Everything okay here? You tell me. I have my people working on it. We're gonna straighten everything out. 
I feel better already. Sorry, but I've got to run. So soon? Aren't you going to stay for a drink? Yeah, Bruce. Stay for a drink? <laughs> I'd love to, but I've got another appointment and I really don't want to be late for it. Oh, all right then. And don't forget to change into your suit. Jeez, just tip him off right there. What did she just set me up for? Yeah, 15 Albert, minutes ago. I'm at the warehouse. <laughs> Let's show up seven no hours later. Catwoman's contact. It's quiet. The sound of an ambush. Stay on guard. This wasn't Thugs, a handoff. Whatever. It was a massacre. It just messed up. How many? I'd have to count the pieces. Oh, good lord. Two, Could have three, done four, such a five, thing. Six. I see at least six. That's what I'm gonna find out. Gordon, Eastside Docks, Warehouse 133. Start with the scorch marks. Analyzing. It's a volatile chemical. Potential psychoactive nerve agent. Vile stuff. Be very, very careful with that. Who knows what effect it may have. Have the computer catalog the compound for further analysis. As you wish. Oh, I can't really walk Nothing around. I guess I can only bury. look at these two things. Interesting. Whatever exploded did so with enough force to obliterate the person standing next to it. But the chemicals themselves were inert, not explosive. Well, it appears to have made a pretty big boom. I'll see what I can piece back together. So it does have a bit of a detective mode, because that was kind of nifty. Oh, I can walk around again. So, last epicenter. Okay, reconstruct what happened by discovering which pieces of evidence best link together to tell the story. Okay. So. I've seen these outfits before. Yes, the people I've you fought at City Hall. Mercs that broke into City Hall. Are they supposed to be like Red Hood? Uh, yeah, Red Hood's guys? Or. Examine the door. I clicked that like three times. The canister exploded, sending shrapnel right through the container door. For once, I'm glad you arrived after the heist. Your armor wouldn't have protected you against that. Is it open? Well, if I'm supposed to be recreating this... Oh, shift in Q. Again! So if I'm recreating it, we know where this ends, then. Looks like a bullet started this. A normal bullet couldn't have caused that explosion. Doesn't appear normal. The point of entry's melted. Okay, so they said the blast ended there, so that would go that away. White Rose. Falcone's calling card. He's been busy as of late. Send the drones hunting. Yeah, I but is that more like everything. just a red herring? Good thinking, sir. Ew. No. That bad? Is he missing an eyeball? Face slashed. Throat torn open. So, not natural causes then. Skylight Club. So 
base torn apart. Who are they trying to make it seem like did this? Because you know that that's what it is. It's all a set. But the damage seems to originate from inside his skull. What did How this? How that even happen? Oh, he's going to pry right in. Ew. Oh, I'm trying to... Oh, oh, go back. Sensors say it's an incendiary route. Phosphorus residue. This could have superheated the contents of the canister. Causing the aforementioned boom. What else is here then? Oh, Blood. bloody hands. Broken nails. Bits of human flesh. Okay. Anything else then before I start to piece this together? Okay. So, is it, was he clawing at this guy, maybe? A cop shredded this merc to pieces, barehanded. God, what would cause someone to do that? The nerve agent could make them psychotic. Are we going to have, like, Scarecrow in here, too? Lincoln to this. Find a connection. The bullet that killed the cop is the same type that blew up the canister. Well, I'm sure they didn't find that at a local gun store. It appears military. Zero. Hold on, can I? I just noticed I can actually look up by doing that. Let's see here. Look around and just make sure. Oh, there is something else. Examine the pallets. Hmm. Canisters were stored here. Canisters of what? I didn't even notice there was another cop over here still. It's a cop. The force grows thinner every <laughs> Thank day. you, Captain Obvious. World's greatest detective, everybody. It's a cop. Something was here when the explosion occurred. The forklift, maybe? Right, can I link these two, then? Someone drove off after the explosion. Have you put it together? Yes. Falcone leaving his rose here. This is a message. Dead cops, stolen chemicals. He's making a big move. All right, so it was high noon at the OK Corral. One of the snipers hit a canister with an incendiary bullet, causing it to superheat and explode. This may have been a distraction or a way of destroying evidence. Cops moved in to stop the theft. Falcone's men gunned him down. Then Damn, that was a nice shot to that dude's throat. Possibly due to the psychoactive nerve agent. A cop ripped up a merc's face with his bare hands. It was put down. Same sniper, same type of bullet. Looks like Falcone's men got what they wanted and escaped. Have you located the shooter? No. I'm really thinking based it's on not two Falcone. impact trajectories, the canister and the dead cop. The shooter could only have a clear shot from there, there, or there. 
and would have contaminated himself with the phosphorus residue. Program the skimmers to pick up that signature. Right away, sir. So we're looking for... Oh. So we're looking for a dude who's crazy. Both targets could have been shot from here, but no phosphorus trace. Can I see both from here? Oh, I can't. There it is. Can you climb out the window? for a spike clear vantage point let's look that clear for that second shot hmm killing time that thing is like recently lit though this is the right spot so where did he go out the window I guess not, it is closed. Trace stops here. Then he should be nearby. Found him. Time to go to work. <laughs> I love the the modulator. <laughs> My turn. <laughs> Don't make me add your corpse to this graveyard. No Coney! Why did he do this? I I ain't telling you nothing. You you can't make oh. me talk. Let's get physical. I ain't telling you, Jack. You trying to scare a confession out of me? I won't break. Your bones will. Oh, string him up and drop him. Can use them as a punching bag. Oh, batting practice. It's true what they said about you. You're a freaking animal. Give me a reason to stop. You know, you can bleed to death without ever spilling a drop. All on the inside. Tell me the plan, or I start swinging. <laughs> Yeah, let's just tip it first. Tell me! The cab woman was supposed to hand over a drive, had the container number we needed, but she flaked. So we had to find it ourselves. Uh, container by container! Someone must have heard us, called the cops. We were told no witnesses! Why risk open war with the GCPD? Some kind of chemicals. <laughs> Falcone wanted them. What are the chemicals for? We were paid to steal them, not ask questions. Please, no, no, oh God. I thought I was just gonna check out his armpit. Oh. I start here and keep breaking until you answer. The chemicals are some kind of explosive, a weapon, I don't know. Falcone said he'd use them soon. Used where? That's all I know, I swear, I swear. I told you everything I know. You're an animal. Oh. Let him go. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. These are cops. Get an ambulance in here. I think I need to call the coroner instead. It's Montoya. Send oh, the cleanup unit oh, to the docks. Oh, oh. Warehouse 133. Yeah. I think I need to tell him. I need to build up that relationship hey, with Gordon. Freeze. Don't move. Stand down, Montoya. No. Thank God, you was about to kill me. You want to tell me what the hell this is all about? I told you he was about to kill me. What are you waiting for? Good to see you too, Gordon. You know each other? Falcone stole a shipment of chemicals. Appears to be a weaponized nerve agent. Causes people to go berserk, turn violent. We need to act before he releases it. 
I got a task force on it. You already have one. Yeah! You're taking this too far, Bruce. Shut up, Alfred. You assume the persona of a bat, but you're not an animal. You beat that man half to death. No, I didn't! I didn't, though. I... Your parents didn't raise you I this way. I beat a barrel. And neither did I. He's still alive, isn't he? And in the hospital. <sighs> Next time, it might be the morgue. Especially now, during this preposterous attack on your family. You must show the world the true nature of a Wayne. Giving everything to the city and then being murdered for it? My thoughts exactly. Every time you leave this cave, You're a good man, Bruce. Good. Just like your parents. Don't lose that. I don't mean to be a doddering old fool on the subject. Trust me, I won't lose my way. It's quite understandable to stray from the path now and again. So long as you can find your way back. You bury the person, Bruce, but you never bury the memory. Sometimes I wish I could. Don't show it. That night, that alleyway, it made me who I am. I can't get it out of my head. That is your gift and your curse. Being Batman can allow you to turn back the tide of treachery that's reached this city's shores or drown you in its sorrow. When you doubt your fate, remember why you started all this. Remember that boy in the alley. I won't forget. Neither so he just took the, the ticket out. Obviously, he puts him in there as a keepsake and a memory and a don't touch, please. Well, oh, we got it open. Back into the fray again. Well, we already know part of what's on this disc. It was supposed to be the containers. Oh, we got the Gotham feed. We got the codex. What's in the news? Oh, the Waynes have long been considered one of Gotham's most respected families, but new allegations have tied family patriarch Dr. Thomas Wayne and his wife Martha to the illegal business dealings of the Falcone crime family. If true, it's possible the Waynes family's staggering fortune, estimated to be in the billions, could be seized by authorities pending on investigation into their current business practices. That would be a blow to the her to heir Bruce Wayne, who has continued his father's practice of using the money for philanthropy. However, Dr. Wayne met a violent end as a victim of a random street crime two decades ago. While there has been no comment on allegations from Wayne, he did hold a private meeting with Falcone uh, crime family head uh, Carmen Falcone at the Wayne's family Gotham City Mansion, which is only adding to the speculation. Ah, you jackasses. What's in the codex? Anything new? Well, now we know who you... Okay, yep, turns out her name is Slim Kyle. So at least that updated. I think you're a fake. I don't think you're actually the total dick that the game wants you to be yet you're the red herring I don't know I feel like Vicky Vale may end up being like bad in this one too all right back it looks like that egg finally cracked and inside mayor Hill was hiding more than I could have imagined this is a complete manifest of Carmine Falcone's criminal organization what in the world was Hill doing with all this Illegal arms dealing, drug running, mob hits, money laundering. Falcone's been involved in everything. Hill could have been building a case against Falcone. To win the election. It would bolster his campaign if he eliminated Gotham's most notorious crime family. This is it, Alfred. With this proof, we can finally knock out Falcone's organization. That whole thing's gonna turn red. Yep. Where would we possibly begin to dismantle it? This is a police matter. There's only one cop we can trust to handle this evidence correctly. Lieutenant Gordon. He could mobilize the entire police force against Falcone. What about that reporter from the Gazette? Vicky. Yes, uh, Miss Vale. She could release this evidence through proper channels. I suppose it comes down to who you want to help most. Ooh. Or who you think could do the most good. 
The only problem is if you give it to Gordon and Hill is really a bad guy or Dent's really a bad guy, they're going to get their hands on it and keep it away. But if Vicky ends up being bad, oh, we're going to give it to Vicky. She faith in me. She cares about the truth. She'll get the story out the way it needs to be told. A wise decision, sir. We'll attack Falcone on two fronts tonight. Vicky through the media, and Batman by any means necessary. Damn right. Whatever Falcone is planning, it ends tonight. He's a spider, Bruce. Eyes everywhere. A dense web of goons poised to trap you. No one has ever managed to bring him down. I haven't tried yet. It's time to suit up. <laughs> the Batmobile. <laughs> this, this is big. You drop a bomb like this, th there's going to be fallout. That not even Falcone can survive. Why give it to me then? You don't know how much I appreciate it, but you're a Wayne. You could have given it to anyone. I need an ally in the press. After handing me something like this? I'd say you got one for life. Falcone's oh. slippery, but this is enough to hang him out They're to They're gonna draw. talk about it over dinner now. Come on, Bruce. What this could do for the city, my career, I'm just wondering what the cost is gonna be. Could be your life It'll if you think about it. it. I don't know, Bruce. Falcone doesn't like bad press. If I run this story, I put a price on my head. See? The next time my name appears in the media, it, God, it might be an obituary. I'll protect you, I promise. Oh, chivalrous, but unnecessary. You're not Batman. <laughs> oh. I always think... But wait, there's more. <laughs> crime in the city. It's a hydra. You cut off one criminal's head... Three more appear in its place. I know. Unless we kill the beast once and for all. Who's even capable of that? My if we don't act fast, that void will be filled by someone far worse. Wouldn't be the first time. Batman's a symbol of hope, and that is better than any army. If Gotham can rally around him, right now he's just a monster of the week. So write a good story it's about it. It's a good him. thing you gave this to me instead of the police. Could end up buried in some evidence locker and not on every screen in Gotham where it belongs. Public attention. That's what brings down men like Falcone. Not a bullet. Though after my story runs, he might get that too. I'll be seeing you, Bruce. Don't make me regret my decision. Is she driving a Prius? It's done. Good. So is our hunt. The drones located Falcone downtown, a place called the Skyline Club. Oh, yeah, I had the, uh... Although you're not dressed for that kind that. of party. Well, I can always change in the car. Oh, shit, it really is the Batmobile. We're out in daylight. I get that they're like off the coast, but no one notices that. Find Falcone. Over the drone, around the house. Okay, so I actually get to control this thing. Cool. Good point of entry. Do I get to go up and down too? Oh, I went up a little bit. Not a whole lot though. There's about two floors worth of view here. <laughs> Tell me another. What's the difference between the Mafia and City Council? I don't know. Aren't they the same thing? Whoa. Only one of them is organized. Ooh. <laughs> You're cute. So, uh, you alone? 
Not anymore, I'm not. Oh, snap. Where's Nikki? In lockup. Again? Christ, Kimmy. What did they pinch him for now? Some hit down at the docks. Nikki? No. I didn't think he was a hatchet man. You and me both. Well, does he got an alibi? Honey, I'm always his alibi. Is that the dude I busted up? To make your round? Yeah, no broken bones. Still healing from the last time, I bet. All it took was a couple of C notes this time. Nice and easy. Nice and easy, my ass. I know you burned powder tonight. The whole city can smell it. I feel like uh, Catwoman's gonna be here. Nothing here. The white rose. Falcone's symbol. A red rose after tonight. That's the most heavily guarded door in the building. Gotta be Falcone's hideout. Well, it won't be as easy as ringing the doorbell. Four armed guards. Spotted. Stealth not an option. I'll put together a plan of attack. Stand by. Stealth not an option. Let's go in there and just kick some ass. I swear to God she sees it. Hmm. Couple of options for taking this guy down. Okay, so... Oh, I actually get to pick how I do this. Okay, so... We can use, like, the little screen thing. Do I get to pick it for all of them? Was there a guy right here, too? Or another one? Oh, yeah, see, there we go. No, we need to use that art. No. We'll use the light and see if I can use the art somewhere else. So that looks like it's far away. Contacts are plugging the tar out of me, too. Alright, so two down. Staircase. Oh, am I gonna throw him through the staircase? Okay, this is here, right? Is that him? No. So where's number four? One, two. Oh, the guy outside. This Duh. one might be tricky. Any ideas? I've got it covered, Al. Upper balcony or... Let's go upper balcony. I think you use the regular balcony, he's gonna be seen. Or he's gonna fly right over. Say, well, I can plan this. Your turn to crash his party. I wonder if some of these can be the wrong choices. Back 
backhand. Just a slap. Did I not do that one in time? Oh, big and goddamn circus freak. Yourself. I just you did it. We're starting. Ah. Ah. He's gonna pull the floor out from under him. Oh. oh. So much for the non lethal, because that could have killed him. How about this one? Can't sneak up on me. Uh, you might want to use that now. Oh. Multiple options. Oh, you know who my lawyers, my lawyers are. Let's not do the fire. Let's not burn him to death. Stay down, Falcone. We can end this now. You've got a lot to learn, kid. Oh, shit. Explosives armed. Fire when ready. I feel like that's gonna kill him too. He needs to learn. You never bring a mounted machine gun to a drone fight. And there was a non lethal choice. You've lost, Falcon. I can do a few more rounds. <laughs> Ah, all right, all right. The chemicals. Where are they? What? I found your calling card at the docks. The white rose. You think I wanted to lead you here? I told you, it's all yeah, a setup. Something reeks about this old thing. And it is a dead bat. Still want to play games? We're all being played here, including you. Those chemicals get so riled up about. They're mine, all right? But someone is trying to cut me out of the deal because I did not make that mess at the dock. Then who did? No, we're done. Gotham's watching now. Ah. Go ahead. Give him a show. I'll be walking free by tomorrow morning. Ha! Gotham. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, we're going to make people trust me. We're going to go for the good. Spill it, Falcone, while you still can. It's the Waynes. <laughs> They're behind all this. What do you mean? You want to save this city? Well, the Waynes are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. <laughs> so we know he's lying in a sense. Thanks for the assist. Now we only have to take one of you down. Open fire! Oh, no! So that would have just got caught on TV too. They just came busting in and firing. Fire and smoke could reportedly be seen from street level tonight. 
the Skyline Club, a high-rise mafia hangout in downtown Gotham, was the arena for a clash between the notorious Batman and alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone, who was found dangling over a 50-story drop. Bet Falcone loved that view. Though I'd say the crime boss getting his is well overdue, Falcone has slipped through the law's grasp for years, but after this dramatic arrest and a stunning expose by Gazette reporter Vicky Vale, Falcone's going away for a long, long time. Yeah, you say and that. Speaking of newly uncovered criminal dealings, oh, here we go. This brings me to the story everyone is talking about the Wayne family. For generations, the big W on the Wayne Enterprises Tower was a reassuring sight. You knew that there was something pure at the heart of Gotham. That this city, for all its faults, was built by good people. But with Thomas and Martha's shining reputation called into question, we no longer have such assurances. And even worse, it seems the apple hasn't fallen far from the tree. Gotham's greatest son, Bruce Wayne, seen here shaking hands with Carmine Falcone. Oh, it's gonna come back to haunt me as now. crooked as his parents. In his defense, Wayne fired back saying, Whoever fabricated these lies about my family, they will get what they deserve. Understood. In a world where the Waynes, our golden family, are corrupt, who So this is like the recap with? of each who episode. Who Gothamites look up to? The supposed hero Batman? Yes. Only time will tell. Meanwhile, We'll keep digging for the truth, but the prominent feeling throughout Gotham. So this is probably going to be the end of the Wayne's episode. Time that's a cool way to tie it up. If that's ending. it. Suit, the car, this entire cave, Master Bruce. Everything I built. I created all of this because I didn't want any more innocent people to die. If Falcone's telling the truth about my parents, then what the hell did we do this for? Bruce, I... What have you been hiding from me? Uh-oh. Alfred! Episode 1, Realm of Shadows, over! Oh, how do we share the choice? Okay. You stick for Harvey, okay? Yep. Moving on. Yep, wow! <laughs> Everybody's doing that one, at least. Did you break the dog shooter's arm? Wow, 50-50. Some people are violent. Wow, a lot of people hooking up Commissioner Gordon. But then a lot of people are 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 playing it safe. How do you share all the choices? That I, I probably just uses their website. You can make a Telltale account and do it. All right, though. So, do we get a preview for episode two? When your parents died, they left me as caretaker of their estate, their son, and their secrets. I would never betray them. But would you betray me? My Batman. Your parents were good wow. people, Bruce. <laughs> no matter what time. that thug Falcone told you. Then swear to me, there's no truth to it. That scoop you brought me on Falcone helped me more than you could possibly know. I owe you one. I'm sure Falcone's taken harder beatings in the past. Hopefully, this one knocks something useful out of him. Hell of a view. Bruce, the Wayne name is toxic. I have to do what's best for my campaign. Who what's just said hell of Gotham? a view? Because that, that did not sound I like Gordon. Distance myself. Ooh. I will find the truth. Along with anyone stands in my way he probably says that line to dent so there we go episode one done not bad not as huge of a twist at the end as uh as a lot of the the telltale games kind of have you know wolf among us it had 
uh, this is a spoiler alert if you haven't played The Wolf Among Us, uh, episode one finished with Snow White's head, and then episode one of The Walking Dead, I don't remember if there was a major twist to that one now that I think about it. It's been a while since I played that one, but it's still pretty good. I, I like the direction they're going. They give you combat, you know, because they know a lot of people are coming from the Arkham games. They still gave you the bit of the detective stuff. It's pretty simple, you know, because like that, uh, the, the first one was, you know, in the in the, the docks there in the warehouse, setting up about six things, connecting the order, you know, it's but it's more about telling a story still. So you get the combat, you, you get the detective work, and you got to kind of feel like Bruce Wayne. A lot of the decision making and dialogue comes from Bruce Wayne. So I think that actually worked out really well. I, I like the direction they're going with it. So pretty good for the first episode. The uh, only thing that sucks is obviously it's episodic. I have no idea if, like, or how many they are shooting to have out this year. Telltale's really good about saying, you know, oh, we're going to do it every other month. I think that's how they did it with the, the first Walking Dead. They said they were going to do it every other month, and it ended up being closer to, I want to say, a full year as opposed to, or a little over a full year as opposed to 10 months. But I could be wrong. My, my timeline could be totally off with that, so... Here's hoping we get another episode or two. What, what are we in? In August, so that would be October and December. So hopefully we get another two episodes this year. Oh, if not, that's going to be a long wait. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, let me know in the comments below if you played and what you picked. And if it was any different. I might actually have to go back and play through just to see a few of the differences. Or maybe go look at somebody else's video. Because I wonder how things play out depending on if you don't shake his hand. And may, or maybe if you work a little bit more with him or you give the evidence to Gordon how it changes. So I, I'd like to know. So if you did any of that, let me know in the comments below. Uh, but as always, comment, obviously, like, subscribe, all that jazz. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Episode 1 done. I will definitely see you guys hopefully in a couple months again for episode 2. But either way, I will see you guys in the next one. Later. Time to get this mask off because I'm burning up under this thing and it's hurting my nose like crazy. <laughs> Bye.